Hello, it's me, Jackalopium. Welcome along. We're back playing some more Amazing Cultivation Simulator. This will be episode 28. Are we going anywhere? <laughs> yeah, this will be episode 28. Uh, let's crack on with some stuff. There's a couple of things on my mind. One of them being I want to uh, promote yet another... In a dis oh, out a disciple to an inner disciple, and it's going to be Mao Fu Ching. Because if you look at her stats, look, her charisma is ridiculous, her int is ridiculous. I could do with a higher the rest of this other stuff, um, but she's got really high social, really high chi sense, etc., etc., etc. Oh, hello, great. Thanks for doing that. But <laughs> while I'm doing some uh, some introduction, okay, let's talk to this guy. Uh, we do have a few more more spirit stones than what we did have. I have been selling off a bunch of stuff, uh, so that's great. Treasure items are worth this. Fine. What have we got? Beast blood, ochre essence, uh, other stuff. Uh, yep, there's nothing I really want. Uh, so I think we sell off all of this gear. What we've got hanging around in the trading area. So get rid of that. That's a thousand already. That's fantastic. I'm going to get rid of all of that cat meat. I just don't like having like little tiny amounts of food. I mean, I should probably get rid of this other stuff. Uh, but there you go. Um, we'll keep it for now. Um, the other thing I wouldn't mind doing is getting rid of these furs. Oh, they are only worth one each, right? So, um, what was it? 98. No, 100. 100? Wow. Okay, so rabbit hide. Bear hide is the same. One, one. Eight, nine. We'll get rid of the boar hide. Uh, and then we'll just get rid of all this other stuff. So give me all of your money. Right, that's a thing. Um, yeah, what I was saying was, where, where is she? Mount Fuching. Um, yeah, good stats. She really should be going up. What I would like to do is send her up into the Law of Nimbus Conquest. That's the one from Wudang. That is the DLC law. Apparently it's pretty OP. Oh, no. Um, but yeah, we've only got a 66% match at the moment. We need to pump her perception and luck. I mean, I know how to pump the luck. You need, like, a, a lucky rabbit's foot. I think I probably do have a lucky rabbit's foot somewhere. And the only other thing you can do, really, is found some branches. Um, I'm still... I still don't think we're there in regard to founding branches. Um, I think we are kind of getting there but i don't think we're there yet we need uh, a large amount of like real estate to do that um i'm thinking of putting one branch up here so yeah that would be a nice big piece of real estate there but i do want to get rid of some of these buildings like this this wood chopper and the iron stonework that i had there i'm thinking maybe i could put it put move that room over here because uh, this is kind of like dead space at the moment this is where supposedly my animals sleep however um, they they kind of just look there he is as if on cue uh, they seem to sleep all over the place though look there's one guy he's just like passed out <laughs> asleep in a field that's fantastic yeah, so there's that. Um, I think the other place I thought of was, I mean, around here maybe, but this is where the 
Cemeteria, so I don't know about that. Or here, maybe? But this is where we're going to be doing, like, a second row of, like, bedrooms and cultivator rooms. I don't know if cultivator rooms have to be inside the branch areas that much. I don't know. Um, so there's that. Um, uh, I think, how many branches are there? Branch name, blah, blah, blah. No. Yeah, is there like, there's like five or six different branches you can, you can found. And those will pump some various stats. Like, I think it's the battle branch that pumps the luck stat. And that is the one we also need for Malfuching to... Uh, to go into the lore of Nimbus Conquest. Look, she also needs a bit of luck. And, yeah, perception. Eep. Um, we could also try and find our lucky rabbit's foot. I did notice that we don't really have... Um, we've got one lucky rabbit's foot. And I looked through on the world map before I started recording. And, yeah, there are certainly no more lucky rabbit's feet around. They're pretty rare. However, there's one thing or two things or ten things I do want to look at. Look, they keep dropping the poo in the like the treasure storage um, because it's uh, very valuable, of course. Poo, guano. Um, uh, not sex. Let's go to world. I have just, just uh, traded to the Demonia Temple. I've just given him a secret talisman. Uh, so that's sent, set me to like zero, like he doesn't hate my guts anymore. Uh, I think what we are going to do is we're going to camp and we're going to send Fearless Chung to camp like he usually does, right? Uh, and then we're also going to send on adventures. Uh, one maybe or ten Let's send send those five guys and we'll go five times each. Go for it. Because apparently you can't gain any resources, but there are a bunch of uh, like events that will spawn when you go an adventure in here. Uh, and again, there's no extra bits and bobs that need to be... Uh, that needs to be uncovered on the map. Uh, so yeah, that is that. Shall we wait until Fearless Chung manages to to get there, and then we'll go and have a look around this Demonia Temple. Like I say, they are the bad guys, but Diplomacy, Demonia Temple, we're on... Straight up to zero. Zero is good. <laughs> like, at least, like, they don't hate my guts. Uh, and I am starting to uh, make my diplomacy my favor with the various sets also. We are starting to push those, like, Sunshade is at 688. Even Fall is at 376. Kunlun at 181. Uh, but yeah, we also need to look at Exultant Sect or Demonia Temple, right? And I'll show you why we need those two places to be on our side. Let's look at Demonia Temple. Let's trade. This guy has a Holy Essence there, right? But it will only... He'll only trade it to us if the favourers reach respect. <laughs> oh boy so that's a lot of favor we need to gain it's also at the exultant sect there's also some holy essences which is why we need to pump this one as well uh so yeah uh thankfully our guys are starting to get very fast blue yeti and fearless chung i think it was just fearless chung wasn't it uh, let's go and have a look around. 
see what there is to see. And because there might be some extra bits and bobs as well that we can we can unlock. Okay, so this is the map as uh, as we spawn in. Where do we need to go? Oh, look at those! They're flipping cool. I'm gonna observe it. Yeah. Uh, we'll try to observe that one as well. Bear moth bone carving. <laughs> Ancient ruins. Yeah, I don't know if um, a serpentist banner. Let's go and collect this sample. Nice. And this sample. Oops. And possibly the sample as well. Yeah, okay. We already have that one. Yeah, I thought we might do. Uh, it looks like this plant we can collect a sample of as well. Pretty sure we can collect these samples without them getting the massive ump with us. Cornflower. Do it. Yeah, there is absolute ton of stuff. Uh, and this is what I thought. There, there would be an absolute ton of stuff to uh, collect up there. Looks like, uh, yeah, look, ancient remains. Let's collect the sample. Is that the same one that we, we collected earlier? Yeah, it's the same one. That is fine. And that one is the same as that one. Great. Yeah, I don't know if we've got this one. And this one. I think we probably do have these ones. Yeah, we've already got that one. And we've already got that one as well. Do we have this one? That's not... Is it the same as that one? Possibly. Nope. So, yep, that's a, another new thing there. Okay, so this has been fairly... Oh, yeah, there's another thing. Another new thing. I think this might be one as well. Whoa, demonic rack. Is that like, uh, like, uh, you know, <laughs> Animalian Ever Burning Lamp? Uh, we do like our demonic racks. Headless Amalian uh, Didgeridoo. Demonia Gate. Oh, there's just so much stuff. Uh, but yeah, I think that's it. Is that everything for right now? It looks like there are some more plants up there. Are they different substantias? They are. Uh, and this is the one we've already got. Camthorn. Uh, 
collecting loads of samples. Uh, okay, so is there anything else? Nice. Uh, so yeah, this is a bunch of stuff what we can build later on. So yeah, already really um, quite a productive map visit. Uh, look carefully, is there any more that we may or may not have? Uh, probably we've got everything. Uh, so yeah, we can certainly build a bunch of like evil looking stuff, which is uh, pretty cool. So like if you want a different aesthetic for a certain different part of your... Uh, your sect. Do you want to uncover a bunch of the... Yeah, there we go. Look at that thing. Demon Lord's Cauldron. What is that? <laughs> Nice. Well, we've got the Demon Lord's Cauldron as well. Um, I think I've already got one of these things. Uh, manual Pavilion, yeah, okay. I've got all of that stuff. You obviously, you don't touch any of this other stuff unless you want to go to war. We don't really want to go to war with anyone. I mean, that is... Often your ultimate goal, or like the playthrough's ultimate goal when people play the uh, play Amazing Cultivation Simulator, and I guess it is for me too. Um, I would like to go to war, but we are miles away from that even now. Um, just there's more good stuff to be had by being allies to these guys. Are the serpent banners different? No, I don't think they are. Did we get this Amanomanalian? Whatever. Okay, yeah, we do. Let's keep going. What are these? Demonic rack. Oh boy, look at those savage statue, do it, yeah, wow, that's awesome, and, okay, so we got the, I assume that this is the their wonder, yeah, that's their wonder, it even looks friggin' cool, so Demonia is like the cool, they're like the cool edgelord lads, Uh, that's awesome. It is a shame there's only one different type of demonic statue, unfortunately, but they know what they're doing, the devs. Uh, but yeah, I would like to see everything, just to make sure we've got everything. Like, do we even have that? Fiend branch? <laughs> Jeez. Uh, 
있죠. 오케이. Okay. We already know that. to actually look for some people. I think we're going to grab four people. Four is a good number. How do we get in this building here? Okay. Lovely cavernous decor. Oh, look at this. I'm loving this decor. Loving this uh, style here. Yeah, we have definitely got some uh, some new stylings to be uh, to be getting on with here. Uh, let us uh, see if we can invite some people. They won't do a too cool for school kind of edge lord thing, will they? Affected by sect and personal abilities. Jong Luzan's favor to your sect increased by three points. Okay. I do know this guy. I know that he likes uh, rubbish. And he likes sacred talismans. Uh, we're still not there with the invite just yet. Ugh. He hates summer pants, man. Um, so yeah, we can... Invite this, guys. Yep, so that's one. Um, so yeah, let's invite this guy. So that's two guys that are coming. Uh, and then... Anybody else? Anybody else? Okay, this guy's a disciple, so... It might be a bit easier to talk to. Oh, nope, this is it's like pulling teeth. Okay, so that's the third guy. Uh, and then we'll grab one more and then we'll do the sign off. Uh, but yeah, that's some really nice furniture that we've uh, got gotten hold of there. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll talk to uh, Lang Rujong.
there you go and then we'll invite this guy as well uh, so that is our four guys uh, and that will probably do it for looking at this sect um it's really nice really uh really nice uh, decor i'm a really big fan the kind of edgelord decor i'm not usually into kind of like edgelord stuff but uh <laughs> this stuff is really nice oh look at all of that stuff that's the treasure room uh, but yeah, you absolutely do not touch anything in these maps uh, unless you want everyone to just like stomp you into the dirt. Uh, so try not to touch anything because otherwise you will probably need to do a, a, a reset. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, there you go. There was Demonia Temple looking around there. All right, see ya. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Oh, hey, you okay? Oh, some damn enchiladas! <laughs>